fear and doubt can coexist. I've been given this beautiful vision. So let me pour some faith in that vision. Let me get into alignment, which we're going to move into in just a second. Talk about step number five of our mindset reset formula, leverage alignment of that vision, that gift that I was given. You are receiving the vision in perfect timing, but it has to start somewhere. So let me share it with this example. Consider I'm holding a a bag of seeds. Look at these seeds. Consider I'm opening the bag of seeds and I poured these seeds in my hand. Please look at those seeds. You see the seeds. Look at those seeds. Those seeds are dormant. They're in a package and they're sold at grocery stores. They're sold at Home Depot. They're they're sold at Ace Hardware. (laughs) They're sold at, at, at a landscape store and they're dormant. But what do they have the potential to do? What do they have the potential to do? And they're dormant. Your ideas, your thoughts that you haven't thought yet, they're in the package. So do this exercise of crafting your compelling vision, step number four, quantum traveling, by just opening the bag of seeds and just look at them. What do they have the potential to do? Now let's take it to the next level. Take those seeds, cultivate the ground, and put those seeds in the soil and cover up the soil. What happens to those seeds? They grow, but how do they grow? This is quantum physics. They grow with an energetic field, an energetic field that exists right now on this planet called growth. It's an energetic field. That seed in the ground calls forth all it needs to germinate. The seed does that. You don't do that as the gardener. You put the seed in the ground and you trust. That seed will call forth all it needs to germinate, to now crack open. And a little stem comes out. And the little stem grows a root. And the root is now an irrigation system that pulls in water and nutrients. That starts growing the the trunk of the tree or the branch of the Uh, of the plant and then the leaves and then it garnishes us with fruit or acorns or flowers. You didn't do that as the gardener. So stop trying to force your seeds of thought. You don't have to do anything but believe and cultivate those seeds. So how does a gardener cultivate the seeds? It gives it water. Are you giving your dreams water? What does the gardener do to help the seed attract all it needs to come to fruition? Sunlight. Are you giving your dreams sunlight? What does a gardener do to make sure that seed calls forth all it needs? Are you hearing the theme here? The seed does all the work through the quantum physics realm of a wave of growth, this potential growth that exists on this planet, the potentiality that exists in the universal forces that be on this planet. What does the gardener not do? Let's say you're the gardener, you plant the seed, you gave it sunlight, you gave it water. In five days, you didn't see a sprout and you're frustrated. My seed's a dud. Would gardeners do that? My seed's a dud. That's supposed to germinate in three days, in three hours, in seven days. So the guard, would you as a gardener dig up the seed and see what's wrong? No. You as the gardener would say, why am I rushing this? It's not time yet. It's not time yet. That gardener never lost an ounce of faith in that seed calling forth all it needs to come to fruition and in perfect timing and you can look at the research it's it's something like 17 days for a carrot 24 days for asparagus 
18 days for lettuce. What's the time frame for your dream? We don't know. But I'll tell you how you stop it from growing. Dig up the seed and wonder why you don't see a result yet. That's the only thing you cannot do. So you have seeds. Seeds are ideas. Seeds are thoughts. Seeds are dreams. And how you water it and give it sunshine is you make it intentional. I intend it. I decree and declare it. I'm in a vibrational state of belief. I cultivate my faith in it. It's just a matter of time. It's already on the calendar. I can't wait to start seeing that seed of intention grow. I can't wait to see the first result of that seed of intention. So relax, chill out, be intentional with who you're being and how you're showing up. But let the seed germinate. It's all happening. It's all coming to you. Just say yes when an idea is there. I say yes. Are your knees shaking? (laughs) Yeah, but I'm saying yes. Did you buy the airline ticket? Yes, and I'm scared shitless, and I bought the airline ticket. Or whatever the nudge is, whatever the inspired action is. Did you write that script, even though you have no time to write the script? This is miraculous. Don't oversee this. You cultivating your faith is miraculous. You are believing in a miraculous realm. ready to learn a formula to help you stop being stuck in fear and level up your productivity to go from being overwhelmed to a high performer to turn your scarcity mindset into an abundance magnet then you want to come to the mastermind retreat in tuscany italy you'll enjoy six magical days immersed in the beauty the culture the richness of the tuscan countryside florence and siena and san gimignano You'll mastermind with other like-minded people in a 13th century castle as you apply my Mindset Reset formula to recreate yourself, your business, and your life. There's only two spots left. Get registered today at lisajcoaching.com forward slash retreats. And I'll see you in Tuscany.